Welcome back to Hot 20. I'm Marley Sherwood coming to you from my home office, I guess, um, here in Seattle. And I'm joined by American Idol champion, Lane Hardy. How are you? I'm great. How you doing? I'm good, thanks. Where are you currently at social distancing, staying safe from everything? Uh, right now, I'm in Livingston, Louisiana, back at home. So uh, I've just been hanging out around the house. Hanging out around the house. Is it easy to social distance down there? It is. It is. It's like really secluded and uh, we're just away from everything. So it's nice. That's awesome. Most of our fans watching know you from American Idol and you were on two seasons of American Idol, which is kind of unique. So tell me a little bit about the difference between the first season that you tried out in and the second season that you auditioned for. Well, the first season, I didn't know like how it worked. I didn't know nothing about it. I was just going into it like oblivious to like how to do anything. So I got like halfway through that season, I think like top 40 and uh, got sent home. And in the second season, I knew a little bit about it. So uh, it made it a little bit easier for me to, to go through different obstacles and different rounds. So when Ryan Seacrest calls your name after the infamous pause that he takes. Lane Hardy! What went through your mind when you found out you were the winner? I mean, it was, it felt like a whole day before he even said it. And in that time we were waiting, it was just so much anxiety built up. And I, I just wanted to know who got it, whatever. He called my name. I was like, oh my God, because it was just unbelievable. It's like left me speechless. Okay, so Luke Bryan, obviously a judge on American Idol, when you were auditioning, he is kind of questioning you on your country cred. Have you ever caught an alligator on a top water plug? No, I haven't. I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> well, it's bass bait. <laughs> I'm getting this boy's country cred. Who would you say is more country, you or Luke Bryan? <laughs> well, George is a little different in Louisiana, so I mean, I feel like he's a lot more country than me. His his accent's stronger for sure. His accent is stronger, really, really strong. He hasn't gone all Hollywood yet, right? No, no, he hasn't. He hasn't. I don't think he will. <laughs> 